What's up YouTube, Tandy2SS back again with another video and in today's video we're going to be comparing Trulicity with Ozempic and I have a very special guest on the channel, my mom, Mom2SS. Hey. <laughs> uh, she has been on uh, Trulicity uh, for a while, she's also used Ozempic so she'll be able to give us a uh, gauge just how good um, these medicines compare to one another uh, and with that let's jump into the video. All right, mom, so let's start with the very first question. How long have you been uh, using Trulicity? For 2 months. I've been using Trulicity for 2 months. You going to give us a little backstory on how you got started using it? Well, I'm a type 2 diabetic and uh, I went to my doctor and actually asked if I can be uh, subscribe to uh, Ozempic. Unfortunately, my insurance company did not approve it, so they put me on Trulocity. And I've been on it ever since. So what what dosage did you start with? Because with Ozempic, I started with uh, 0.25, moved up to 0.5. Currently, I'm at uh, one milligram. Actually, I need to go up to 1.5, but uh, that is a a topic for another video. So, how what did you start with in terms of dosages? I started with uh, 0 0.5, 0 0.5. 0.5? Yeah. Um, so, where are you currently at? I'm at 1.5 now on Trilocity. So, how long did it take for you to move uh, from each dosage? Was it every four weeks, or how long did you? It was every. It was basically every four weeks or more. Okay. More so, did you have any side effects with any of the dosages? I do have side effects with the Trulocity. Every time I inject it, I get like an irritation, an itchy feeling around that injection site, and it kind of swell up, so whether it's, like, it's in my thigh or my stomach. It doesn't matter where I inject. So it's like uh, like you're allergic yeah, to the, kinda like the injection. A, yeah, mm -hmm. and I'm going to inform my doctor. I've been noticing it, but I haven't been back to the doctor for like two months, so I'm going to inform him of that. Okay, so uh, did you find that it took away your appetite at all? No. It made me hungry. So it made you hungry? Yes. It, made me, <laughs> so, it makes me cray. So with each each dosage, did you find, like, did the hunger increase or was like there was a, you just felt like you were just eating more, <laughs> just, more just, than you were before yeah, you started using it? Yeah, I was using. eating more before I started using it. It increased my appetite. Mm hmm so since you've been losing it, or since, you, since you've been using it, have you lost any weight at all? No, I haven't lost any weight at all. I probably gained it. And how long did you say you've been on it? Ten months. For ten months, and you've <laughs> lost no weight. No weight. Um, which happens, right? It, it, it happens for certain people. Some people, they may have to go to like the max dosage allowed before they actually started losing weight. Um, but it's interesting that um, you know you you haven't lost anything, and in fact, you said you've probably gained weight. I don't know if that's the norm, <laughs> but it's 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 been her experience so far. Uh, but I guess the more important question would be, how's your your blood sugar levels, like your your A1C and, and, and my A1C? Actually, Trulicity has done its job with stabilizing my A1C. That that I can say is a good thing. And all in all, that is the most important thing, right? As long yeah. as your blood sugar levels are under mm -hmm. control, um, that's what the medication is is meant for ultimately, because with diabetes, your blood sugar goes incredibly high. It started starts uh, damaging uh, veins and vessels, and you know all these these you know tubes in your body, and you know starts to lead to uh, you know side effects and, and things that you don't want to happen. So uh, it's important that that those blood sugar levels stay you know stay normal and regulated as possible. So but yeah. So would you recommend uh, the medication to somebody else? Absolutely, I would. I would recommend the medication, uh, Trilocity. If you basically, if, if you not, you know, if you don't want to lose weight, it's excellent. Me myself, I would love to lose weight and maintain my blood sugar levels, my C1. Mm. Mm. So let's talk about your experience with Ozempic because you did use uh, Ozempic for a while. Mm -hmm. um, how was your experience with with Ozempic? My experience with Ozempic was great. I lost appetite. I wasn't eating, you know, eating frequently, um, and I started losing in inches. I started losing. I I could actually see and tell the weight 
floss with Ozempic. And then unfortunately, I didn't have any more. <laughs> so, so you kind of ran out, you didn't have any, yeah. your doctor, so your insurance company wouldn't uh, cover the cost of Ozempic, They right? would not cover the cost of Ozempic, no. Uh, which is unfortunate, right? Because ultimately, if, you, if your doctor, you know, prescribes you this medication and um, obviously you need it, it sucks that your insurance company can step in and say, no, we're not, we're not, you know, we're just not going to pay for this. Um, we want a cheaper alternative and then you use the cheaper or alternative and you may not have the results that you would have with the medication that you were prescribed so uh it's kind of it's kind of weird it's kind of weird and unfortunate in that regard well my doctor he explained it to me where it wasn't really a cheaper alternative mm -hmm. he said that it's like coke and pepsi they both do the same thing but by me being on both i they don't mm -hmm. they're completely different. I mean, they regulate their blood sugar. That's where they're, they're saying. Mm -hmm. But as far as weight loss or, you know, lack of appetite or whatever, True Life City just doesn't do that. So what do you think is better? I think you've already answered that question, mm -hmm. but what would you say uh, the better medication has been in your experience? My experience is theosympic because I want to lose the weight. Mm -hmm. You know, I want you know, my AC wants to level up, but. I mean, level you down. Know. Well, I mean, <laughs> we don't want him to level up. Yeah. <laughs> I want to see. We want him to go. New term, level up. No. No, I want. want to yeah, down. I want it to go down. And, yeah. yeah. So you would, you would say that better experience has been with Ozempic. It, it was with Ozempic. Yeah. So, I mean, again, it's apples and oranges. Um, I think there have been reports recently that states that, like, Trilocity was actually. Uh, more potent with weight loss than Ozempic um, over time uh, at the max dosage. I think people lost an average of like 34 pounds or something. Uh, I could be mixing that up, but um, I'm pretty sure that that's what I read. And um, it's interesting, right? You, you, some people's experience is just different, right? Some people, um, you know, their journey with the medication is just completely different from somebody else's journey with the medication. It's just at the end of the day, it's, it's all about what works for you. So please talk to your doctor. Uh, hopefully this gives you a little bit of insight of what my mom's experience has been uh, with the medication. And with that, you can make a more informed decision uh, when you approach your doctor uh, with this information. Uh, and with that, I will see you guys in the next video.